velocity. We will find out what is the definition of velocity. So the definition of velocity is just like speed but it differs in one aspect wherein velocity has a direction. Velocity of a body is the distance traveled by it per unit time in a given direction. Hence we say velocity represented as V is equal to distance traveled in a given direction which is missing in the speed. Speed is just distance traveled whereas in velocity we say distance traveled in a given direction which is represented as S divided by time taken to travel that distance. Velocity is also defined as displacement experienced by the body which also can be represented by S divided by time taken. Hence V is equal to S by T which is meter per second the unit or in other words S is equal to V into T which is meter where V is velocity, S is distance and T is time. Distance is in meter, time is in seconds, so velocity is meter per second. So the units where velocity are meter per second or meter second minus 1. And it is a vector quantity as it depends on the direction as per the definition. To understand it better, we will see an example wherein let us say a car is moving from a reference point O to a reference point A. And O to A the distance is 50 km and car takes 1 hour to travel. Now once it reaches A, it moves back to a point B which is 20 km away from A and takes half an hour to travel. Now with this data, let us find out what is the velocity. Velocity is as per definition displacement by time taken. In this case, the car traveled from O to A to B. So the displacement experienced by the car is O to A and A to B. So O to A minus a to B. It means 50 km minus 20 km which is 30 km. We need to understand here one thing that is basically when the car moved from position O the final position of the car is B. Since initial position of the car is O final position of the car is B. So the displacement is 30 km and time taken for this displacement is 1 hour from O to A plus half an hour from A to B. So it is 1 plus half hour which is 3 by 2 hour. Therefore the velocity can be computed as displacement 30 km by 3 by 2 r which is 30 into 2 by 3 km per hour. So 3 tenths which is 20 km per hour. Therefore 
velocity is 20 km per hour for this car during this journey. Let's see a simple example to describe velocity. If a car travels a distance of 100 km and 4 hours in the north direction, then we say velocity of the car is equal to the distance travelled in the north direction divided by time taken for this travel. In this case it is 100 km divided by 4 hours. So which is 425. So 25 km per hour due north. Very important to mention the direction. So we say due north. So the answer is velocity v is equal to 25 km per hour due north.